Happy Halo Days from Rising Potential, JKB Rising. Hi, everybody. So, Halo 4, we're back again. Um, so, yeah, happy holidays. Um, happy Halo Days. Merry Christmas. Happy Kwanzaa. What's the other one? Kwanzaa. Christmas. There's one more. Kwanzaa. Happy Hanukkah. There we go. Kwanzaa, Hanukkah, Christmas. Happy Halo Days. Happy Holidays. I say Happy Halo Days because I like playing Halo, and uh, I think it's actually a nice fit. Uh, Bungie actually made that, like, I think back in 2010 of, yeah, 2010 of, uh, of, uh, Christmas where they said Happy Halo Days with the poster of, like, Noble Team and Master Chief. Anyway, Halo 4, so yeah, I've been playing Halo 4 recently with my friends. Not by myself, with my friends. And, uh, I've been doing so freaking well that I get, like, an untouchable in this game. This is my first ever untouchable, hopefully not my last. Uh, but yeah, um, Halo 4 has been... Tremendous amount of fun. I, I play with my friend uh, from work from Best Buy for about two days straight after work And it was just such a blast. I gotta tell you um, I've never had so much fun playing a multiplayer game in my life Not because I was doing really good and not just like good like really good I've been I, I, I was getting I, I got multiple rampages. I got one untouchable uh, and this is in a couple games I got so many frenzies running riots. I got triple kills. As you saw that Kilimanjaro, which I'll upload the gameplay later. I got so many sniper headshots. I out DMR'd people who had the battle rifle. Um, I just, uh, I, I did so well. I, 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 I never did that good in my life playing any multiplayer game ever. And uh, it's so satisfying in this game to do well. Um, and they reward you by doing well. Um, and, you know, you may not get the best weapons by doing well, but it's fun to use the standard weapons, like the DMR, the battle rifle, the assault rifle. Every weapon, including the pistol, is fun to use. Like, when you get a headshot, uh, like, in this game with the sniper, like, it feels great. Like, it says the headshot medal, and then and, and, and then the announcer is like, snapshot, like, if you get, like, a no-scope. And, like, when you get, like, multiple sprees, you know... The announcer actually cares, like, killing spree. He doesn't just say killing spree, he says killing spree! Like, he's so into it. Um, so, like, when you get, uh, like, the guy going, RAMPAGE! It's just, like, he's yelling it. And, uh, I miss a couple headshots in this game, but I'm trying to get better at the sniper. Um, and this is actually how I taught myself After Effects, which is kind of, like, a completely off-topic thing, but it's kind of similar. Like, the best way to teach yourself After Effects is to teach yourself. You gotta self-teach you. For me, the best way to get better at Halo is obviously to self-teach you. Um, like, you can watch tips and tricks, but you're not going to learn anything unless you actually get down there and boom, headshot. Uh, and, 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 like, you do it. Uh, one thing with the pistol, I, I, I found out from my friend who's really good at it, is that the only way you can do really well with the pistol is headshots. you got to aim for the head every single time you use the pistol. If you miss one single headshot, you are dead. So, like, if you, like, shoot the head, like... A couple times, but then hit the body, then you're not gonna make it. Um, so every time I use the sniper, I try to go for the head, but I might miss it, so I go for the body. Um, but I don't die in this game. I do. Oh man, this game was so much fun. Um, and it's not like I was camping out for like half the game when I got like an untouchable. I was actually moving around. As you can see, I'm out in the fucking open. Um, so you know, it's 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 not like that. I camped it out. And, like, even when I got a Rampage or an Untouchable, I still, st like, kept trying to kill them. Um, so, you know, I am missing a couple sniper shots, uh, but I'm trying to get better. So, happy Halo Days. Um, what did you guys get for your Christmas or whatever you celebrate? Uh, I have not opened my presents yet, so I can let you know. I'm actually recording this before, uh, my family actually starts opening up presents. My sister's still away, my dad's over now, my mom's here, my sister's coming over, then we're gonna set up presents. Uh, we actually don't have our presents under the Christmas tree yet, just because, uh, our dogs like to chew stuff, so we're holding our presents upstairs before we bring them all down. Um, but yeah, Christmas, Christmas, Christmas. I think Christmas has transitioned from a religious holiday to, a assassination! Oh, up, oh, up, oh, up, oh, oh, assassination! I love the announcer. Okay. Um, oh, that was such a badass. Oh, yeah, the commando helmet. Off topic, off topic. Um... 343 did this 343 day, which is the 343 day of the month. I think that's, or of the year, that's uh, December 12th is now 343 day. So we got Bungie Day and 343 day, um, which I think is pretty sweet. And, uh, yeah, so 
uh, the Commando Helmet, you played this game type, um, I forget what game type it was, but play any game, I guess, uh, on 343 Day, and then a couple days, they will uh, award you with the Commando Helmet, and only the Commando Helmet. And that's uh, one w w when you get Killing Frenzy! That's only one when you get uh, when you get the Dominion Victory, which means you have to get every single Dominion combination um, to get the Commando Armor set. Well, they just gave you the Commando Helmet, which I thought was pretty sweet. And uh, ever since, ever since I put the Commando Helmet on, I've been doing games like this. I think it's the helmet that's making me play so well. Uh, it's been out, I, again, I, I've been completely shocked and just how good I'm doing. And like, I'm so diverse in this game, man. I'm using the sniper, the pistol, the battle rifle. I'm just, I'm using everything in this game to just win. Uh, it's been great. It's, it's been completely awesome. Like, oh man, this game is so much fun. I wasn't a big fan of the campaign, but the multiplayer, they slammed the multiplayer. Then, you know, th there's a few minor things they have to fix. Like, I think the scatter shot's still a bit powerful. That freaking, um, what's that, 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 that Promethean rifle, the sniper rifle, that thing, that one-shot kill, I don't think that should be one-shot kill, that's like, that's way, like, maybe like a, actually, that's, I, I, I really don't know, but, ASSASSINATION! RUNNING RIOT! Yeah, I love it. Freaking going up, motherfucker. Look at that, across the map shot. Again, this game has been, like, if you s heard me in this game type, like, I am behaving how I am right now. I'm just freaking out, because I'm doing so well. I'm having so much fun. The announcer is so into it. My friends are kicking ass. It's it's great. It's great. And people could say, well, you're facing bad players. Who cares, man? Halo is about having fun. Video games is about having fun. And this game type, this gameplay was so much fun. And again, like that night was just crazy. Every game was just like this game. Every single one. If I died, I would get numerous multi-kills. If I didn't die, I would get numerous sprees. Um, again, this game was just so much fun. And I didn't use any vehicles. I'm not a big fan of vehicles in Halo, I'm not going to lie. Except for the tank. The tank's fucking badass. Uh, every other gun, or, like, maybe that's an improvement that, that they could fix in Halo 5, or the next Halo for Xbox One, like, give me a, an incentive to get into a vehicle. I almost die here, I kinda, like, freak out, as you can see right there, but I made it still, I was gonna freak out if I died. Uh, that's where I, I just completely went clutch, I'm just like, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, fuck, and, like, I just panicked. Um, but luckily he was not good enough to beat me, cause I'm the inheritor, motherfucker. I'm the inheritor. So, um... Yeah, going back to my original topic, I think uh, Christmas has evolved to a, uh, uh, obviously a business holiday. Um, it's all about buying presents, and um, I think uh, I think it's fine for people who aren't religious to celebrate it. Uh, I, I, I think it's more about celebrating, I guess, the fun of Santa Claus, you know, and like all those fictional stories like Rudolph and stuff like that. And you can celebrate, you know, Jesus Christ. Uh, I don't think it's, like, in my opinion, I, I don't think it's real. Um, but I think now it's evolved to, you know, yes, I'm kind of contradicting myself by saying you should uh, celebrate Santa and Rudolph and not Jesus Christ when, it when it's the same thing, both being fictional. Um, uh, uh, again, I'm not, I, I, I think uh, Christianity's fictional. I'm not trying to be a dick. Um but, uh, RAMPAGE! Uh, yeah, I think, um, I don't know, just from my, um, perspective, I think it's just more fun to do that. And I almost died here, too. That light rifle guy is really skilled. Plus, the light rifle takes your shield down in four shots, so I almost died there. I'm taking cover because I don't want to die, because I, I still need to get that freaking untouchable. Um, but I don't know. Christmas to me is just celebrating t time with your friends, time with your family, uh, the one day that you're not yelling at each other, um, and, uh, just opening up presents, having, a, ha like, having a good time. That's what it is. Like, Christmas should be every day. It shouldn't just be one day. It should be every day. You just having fun and relaxing and getting gifts. Every day should be like that. Um, sadly it's not, but, uh, I guess that, I, I, I guess that's why Christmas is special. So I'm an atheist. I, I I don't believe in God, and I celebrate Christmas just because I think it's evolved to the point where you can celebrate it, even though you're not religious. Um, and anyone can celebrate it. Like you don't have to be Christian. You don't have to be an atheist. You don't have to be uh, Muslim to celebrate uh, this holiday. You can do it in your own special way. 
So that's my perspective on Happy Holidays, Happy Halo Days. Apparently there's a war on Christmas. No, I have not heard of this war. Or I've heard of it, but I haven't seen it yet. Um, I think it's all bullshit, so... Um, if, I mean, like, if you think there's a war on Christmas, then believe whatever you, like, you want to believe. But trust me, there's no war on Christmas. At least not from my perspective. Um, anyway, Halo 4, I, it's been so much fun. It's been so much fun. I, I always wanted to give, like, tips and stuff. Like, people say, just stick to machinimas. I like commentating, you know? I... I, I don't care who doesn't watch these videos. I just like making them. Um, I like talking. So, and I, and I love Halo. And I have so many game t uh, plays now. I have like 20 gameplays saved up of me doing really good in this game. So, um, I would like to do... I mean, I don't know if, if, if I could do like tips or anything. Because, I mean, all I really do is just... I, I, I just go in and, and I just kick ass. It's pretty much all that I do. That's all that I do. Untouchable! Yeah, there you go. 25 kill streak in a row, baby. In a row, untouchable in Halo 4. Yeah, boom, sniper kill. So uh, apparently the perfection's a combination. I thought it was a medal in this game. It turns out it's a combination. So I got a couple of those in this game. So anyway, this is James of Rising Potential, JKP Rising. Happy holidays, happy Halo days, happy Kwanzaa, happy Merry Christmas, happy. Hanukkah. Happy Halo Days, motherfuckers. Go out and play some games, have some fun, chillax, and uh, take it easy, because today is a day where you just want to relax. Anyway, thanks for watching, and uh, let me know what you got on this day. Anyway, I'll see you later next time on Rising Potential. Take me rising! Signing out. Peace out, motherfuckers!